Quispy. Hello, and welcome to being a fat kid in the army. So right now, the way that I look, uh, I am, I am fat by the army standard. I am 226 pounds and I am 24% uh, body fat because my neck is a 16 and a half. My waist is a 39, which means that I'm at 24% body fat. Because we have a weigh-in on Monday for the PT test the following week, I have to cut weight. And as I am a fat kid per the army, I'm gonna show you how fat kids cut weight. So it's a very dumb process how you lose weight, but uh, I basically have to lose 20 pounds. All right, so I'm gonna show you how we do it. So first thing you're gonna need is magnesium citrate. Second thing you need, saran wrap. Third thing you need is some hemorrhoid cream. And last but not least, a lot of hard work and dedication. So what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be drinking some magnesium citrate today and tomorrow. That's gonna get rid of some bloating because it's a laxative. So I'm gonna be doing a lot of pulping. We're gonna take some saran wrap, which I'll show you later on. And we're gonna wrap around my waist with some hemorrhoid cream. The hemorrhoid cream is going to shrink our skin cells, which is going to make our waist smaller because the only thing the army cares about is do you weigh a certain weight or does your neck and your waist match a certain measurement? That's it. They don't care about how well you can do on your PT test or how strong you are or how long you can run or ruck or do any type of thing that requires your job uh, technically wise. They just care about how you look. So since I'm in the army, this is what we gotta do. People said that was gonna taste disgusting. Everybody! This tastes good. Oh, Lemon flavor, would recommend. So today's Saturday. Uh, Monday's the weigh ins. <clears throat> so today we're restricting the calories and uh, ramping up the magnesium citrate. And I'm allowed 40 ounces of water for the day today, um, total. So I'll be drinking that over the course of the day today. And then come tomorrow, there's gonna be no food, no water. So for lunch today, it's going to be liquid uh, greens. Yummy. I hate these things so much. Yummy. They're so disgusting. But, uh, that's what we gotta do, right? This is a bad case. This 
All right. Half of a shake it is today. Just spent two hours in the gym doing cardio. I had a sweatshirt, sweatpants, double socks, all that fun stuff. My heart rate stayed at around 140 to 150 the whole time. Weighed in today at 127. Today's Sunday, by the way. Um, super out of breath. This cut's gonna suck. I uh, just drank my magnesium citrate. So that'll start working in about two hours. And uh, no food, no water today. I already weighed myself, Let's see where we're at. <laughs> All right. Is it dirty? All right. Is it dirty? <laughs> yes. <laughs> they haven't put it in the paint. Whatever that thing is. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. I even have it labeled for you. All right. So uh, weigh-ins were supposed to be yesterday. Today. Oh. oh. Yesterday. No, I guess you're right. There were <laughs> they were supposed to be today, uh, oh. but we had a, a two-hour late start because Fort Carson is the best duty station in the world um, due to it snow. Was, it was icy. Yeah, I mean, not really. In the morning, it was. It was really slushy and icy. So uh, okay, you were up at my time. I taped myself this morning. Wouldn't you know it? I was at a 36.5 waist, so I was at 20% body fat. Per the army. Um, tomorrow we're getting weighed, uh, and the final step, if you want to be buff and be in the army at the same time, uh, and also eat some burgers every once in a while instead of a strict chicken and rice diet, that's what you gotta do. Emory cream. You take your preparation H. <laughs> I'm not kidding. This is what you do. You take your preparation H, all right? It comes a little piercer on the label. Pierce it, all right? Now here's the cream. You take that cream and you just get a good dollop. Oh, is this gonna be cold? Oh, it is. And you just spread that bad boy all around. So you spread it everywhere. You spread it on the sides. You spread it right here. It smells disgusting. I get it on my love handles, because I have big love handles. I like your love handles. <laughs> well, the army doesn't. <laughs> They're <laughs> nice you, to touch. Get your hemorrhoid cream. Save with your chest. Wow. Rub it on your love handles. Hey, it's like you put it, it's like if I put my coconut cream on my belly. <laughs> That's what it looks like. Same concept. <laughs> Rub it all on your belly, all nice and good. So now, I lied, I'm not ready. <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> so now that you're all nice and lubed up, don't you need more? You're gonna take your saran wrap, Hold on. and you're gonna wrap your waist really, really tight. So you're gonna suck your gut in, then you're gonna wrap your waist, and you're gonna sleep. When you wake up, the hemorrhoid cream shrinks your skin cells, and so you're going to be skinnier, which means you're going to lose body fat per the army. Now you're ready to go to bed, and through the power of magic and science, overnight this will shrink your waist, which is all the army cares about. Alrighty, so weigh-ins are complete. Came in at 220 pounds, and I had a 16 and a half neck and a 37.5 waist. Uh, I started with a 39 to 40 waist, depending on how you measured it. And I know what you're thinking, right? You're thinking to yourself, why don't you just lose weight? And that way you're not fat. And that way you can pass tape without doing all these extreme measures. But you have to understand that I've been trying to lose weight for seven years now while I've been in the army. And it's not as simple as being able to just 
eat less and then suddenly lose weight, right? Because I still like to lift. I still like to work out. And when it comes time for ruck marches or physical challenges that we do as uh, a company or as a platoon, I normally do better than most people. So there's definitely something to be said about this uh, whole tape system. And I and many other people are under the same impression that the tape system sucks badly. Uh, I had a kid today who was skinnier than me. And he was 24% body fat, which means he doesn't pass. So it doesn't make any sense at all. I don't get it at all. But that's what we have to deal with, right? Because we're in the army. So I honestly believe as this ACFT becomes a thing, that the army's going to reconsider this system of measuring body fat percentage. Because... Your neck and your waist are just, they're, they're two arbitrary numbers, right? Your waist is definitely a unit of measurement, and that makes sense, right? But if you get a certain PT score or higher, you shouldn't have to do this. I get a 250 PT score, which is 50 points of improvement that I could have, but 180 points is the bare minimum. So I'm not doing the bare minimum. I'm doing fairly well, and... I'm barely passing tape, so it's whatever. I'm reading a book. It's helping me out. It's called Fast Lost Forever. It's by Lane Norton. It sounds a really, really cheesy title, but the book has a lot of really good information about calories, basically saying, hey, if you want to lose weight, it's going to take time, and you're going to have to just deal with that, and that's where I'm at. I'm just going to have to deal with that. It's going to be a slow progress, and I'm going to cut weight to where I need to be, and then... Hopefully someday I won't have to do all these extreme measures. So that's the life of being a fat kid in the army. Uh, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Four principles, one goal. Love you guys. Bye. Hey, go to the best. Uh, hey, say it with the chest. Uh, hey, God, uh, wave them high. Side to side. Let them know we gon' rise. We gon' shine. Hey. Let's go. The opening. Oh, I found it. Did you dry off with my towel? <laughs> no. I don't want your head more cream on me. It's not on you. Oh my gosh. Stop. <laughs> We're going to be here all night. I'm trying to figure it out. It's all white. I can't see. It's like tape. <laughs> You're not even pulling in the right spot. You're not even pulling in the right spot either. I'm like Spongebob when he looks like a like, <laughs> 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 He looks like what's a bird? It's a chicken.